Hi, welcome back. This is the last uh, video in this tutorial series, and I'm just going to show you how to export the game um, either as a zip file or as an executable file. Uh, whichever way you uh, decide to export it is up to you. Zip is probably the best way, but if you want to make it as an executable, then you can. Um, we're going to um, export, and I'm going to demonstrate the game plays. Okay, so we're looking at the toolbar. Okay, and here there's create an executable. So I'm looking here on the toolbar. If I click that button, okay, it asks me whether I want to package it as an installer, which means I could install the application onto a computer or package it as a zip. Um, usually package as a zip is what you're going to be required to do for your um, um, assessment, for your uh, control assessment, for your NEA. So we're going to go with packaged as a zip. So I'm going to click package as a zip. And it's going to ask me where do I want to export the um, the game to. So I want to export. I've I've just chosen a folder. So this is uh, on my uh, in a folder called game export. So I'm going to save my fold my file. And what you'll find is when I click that down the bottom here, okay, you will find that it starts compiling the game into a zip file. So I'm going to click save. You can see down the bottom here, okay, what's going on? There's my game. Okay, so. Um, just to show this works, what I'm going to do is to close down um, the um, game maker. I want to exit. Yes, I do. I want to save my changes. Okay, so there we are. We've closed down game maker. I'm going to close down this other one because I've got to open. Okay, okay. So you can see the game maker is now gone from the um, the uh, the taskbar at the bottom. So let's. Uh, Right click on this and let's um, let's extract the file. So we'll, I'll extract it to a folder called Where's My Hat. There it is. I'll say there are three files. You need all three files for this game to run. Okay, so I'm just going to double click on Yo, Where's My Hat. And you can see now the game is open. Okay, there is no uh, game maker um, open apart from the, uh, this is the actual game itself. So I'm going to press enter to start the game. All my sound works, all my controls work, all my scoring system works. Okay, so I've now um, successfully exported my game to um, a zip file, which allows me to run the game um, on any machine, or at least any Windows based machine. Um, there are other options for exporting, but we're not going to go into those uh, in this series. Just want to show you that uh, it does come up with the end game screens as well. So there we go. And then I can press enter to start again, or I can close the game down and um, just uh, finish the game. So um, I hope you've you've enjoyed this series, and um, you've uh, you've learned um, all you need to do for um, your NEA for Game Maker. So thanks for watching, um, and I'll see you in another tutorial soon. Thank you. Bye.